Good evening and welcome to our post-game interview. Joining us, our, assist, our Terra Firma Jeep assistant coach, Gian Carlo Nazario, and our best player of the game, Alex Cabagnot. Congratulations, coach, and congratulations, Alex. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Alex, how does it feel to uh, be winning now in a different team? Uh, well, um, obviously, yung mga preparations nila coach, yung mga preparations namin. We wanted to, obviously, uh, hopefully it turns out into a, a good performance and we had a good performance today. Pero even if we would have lost today, ang ganda pa rin ang mga preparations ng mga coaches, ng mga players. So I'm just happy that we won. That's a bonus. Pero it's been great so far. Um, can you talk about the chemistry of the team, uh, including Hester? Ako? Yes, please. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> so, you know, Hester's been here, uh, and he's not like the superstar import, but he's actually, you know, we he gives us passes, he gets us rebounds, he hustles, and he's doing his he's doing his part, and we're just trying to sinusuklian lang namin see Hester because his effort is tremendous. He is a superstar. Sorry, sorry. He is a superstar. Thank you, Alex. Coach, the breaks of the game seem to go your way in the end game. What do you think is a crucial play that sealed the win for you? Well, um, I think it would be the last shot ni, ni Aldrich, no, that sent it into overtime. I think the change, the complexion of the game, especially we headed to another fight. We were headed to another five minutes and um, we were just lucky to have someone like Alex to, to, who can lead, who can be another coach inside the court, especially we, as we all know, see Coach John is still recovering from his injury. And, uh, you know, we just wanted to give a good showing, especially with what the team has been going through the past few weeks, the past few months with Reuter, Coach John being injured. And then, yes, two days ago, the brother of, uh, the brother of Ronald, uh, Coach Ronald passed away. So, you know, we just wanted to give something positive for the team and the, for the fans of Terra Firma. Thank you very much, Coach. Now we turn you over to our press friends. First up is Mr. Ray Hogue. Uh, hi, Alex. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Hi. Uh, I'd, like, I, I'd like to ask you how comfortable are you now with your new team? Seems like uh, you're, you're no stranger to them. Parang comfortable and comfortable ka. Well, I got to give thanks to them because they welcomed me with open arms. You know, coaching staff, you know, players, uh, the behind the scenes, you Ronald and the utility. Uh, they, it was a seamless uh, transition for me. And uh, it's been going well so far. So hopefully, tuloy tuloy, we can't celebrate too much because uh, we still have a long conference. conference. And uh, it's, it's been great so far. Thank you. Yeah. Uh Follow-up question kay Coach. Coach, uh, last conference, uh, Terra Firma was able to perform well. Uh, I think uh, they just lost the playoff spot because of the quotient system. So what, what do you see in your present team now having uh, an Antonio Hester as import? Uh, well, if um, we've been discussing this, um, coming coaching staff, and uh, we really know um, we felt... Uh, we fell short last conference, and we really felt that we deserve to, na deserving coming maka ano to the next level. But you know, it happens. Kasama din sa learning namin yun as a new coaching staff and 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 as a new team. And having Hess around uh, has has really has really helped and changed the changed the the atmosphere of the team, especially sa sa practice. He's very humble. He jokes around. With, with the locals, even with the coaching staff. So, magaan, just like what Alex said, the, the atmosphere in our practice is very light. Uh, and, um, you know, it all starts there. And nakikita naman namin pagdating dito sa court, we're all enjoying pa rin. Thank you, Coach, and thank you, Alex. Thank you. Up next is Mr. Bon Lozada. Hey, Coach Gian, congrats po sa panalo. Thank you, Bong. Um, coach, uh, can you describe po yung composure level ng team no overtime? Because um, kahit pressure pack situation yun, your players still were still able to get the win. And Hester was even coaching with the referees kanina. Yeah, um, our, our game against Phoenix, um, hindi kami nakatapos ng maayos eh. 
and we were talking about finishing games uh, in our practice yesterday. Because one day apart lang yung game. So, you know, practice yesterday was very short and very light. But it was really more of telling the players that we have to learn how to finish games. Uh, even Lester Prosper, uh, nasa Viber group namin siya, he was telling us to learn how to finish games. And um, ito na, uh, hopefully this is a, a, good, a good sign and hopefully we can carry out as we go on. Um, thank you, Coach. Uh, Alex, quick question lang. Oh, same question? What was the question? Um, yeah, yeah, similar question. Um, can you describe your composure level ng composure level mo and ng teammates mo, especially you had two two big assists to close the game out? Um, well, I just have to give thanks to the coaches. Um, we practiced the play. We didn't run anything out of our uh, out of the ordinary. We stick to the the things that we were practicing, and we didn't. I mean, we didn't do anything special with yeah. the coach. We we run those plays all the time and. It just so happens, Aldrich is a, you know, he's been in the league for a long time. Like, composure talaga yun. Tapos yung mga, we have younger guys, but, you know, this is just, you know, these are just games to get your stripes. So, uh, hopefully, makuha nila yung stripes nila in the PBA and hopefully, tuloy-tuloy yung composure namin. Pero nothing's guaranteed. We still have to continue to work and, uh, you know, follow the coaching and the management. Thanks, Alex. Congrats. Thank you. Up next is Mr. Ruben Terado. Good evening po. Uh, this question is for Coach Gian. Coach, congratulations. Uh, Thanks, Ruben. But, um, Coach, yung ano na lang, um, I, I want to ask about this opportunity na nabigay sa'yo to handle uh, this team with Coach Jan, uh, yung uh, injured. So, uh, what can you say about this opportunity na nabigay sa'yo? And yun na, uh, coaching the likes of Yung si Alex Cabagnot and other other PBA players, coach. Siyempre, being in the high school and in college dati. And even before pala, coach. Yeah. Um, actually, I, I'm not really, um, how would I say it? I, ayokong ip, i, ano siya as an opportunity, no? Kasi um, it's my job as a head assistant to, you know, to have coaches, uh, coach John's back if uh, things doesn't go well. And, um, Ito naman, it's a it's a conscious effort uh, between the coaching staff and of course uh, the players. Uh, we approach them, we talk to them, and see what's comfortable for them. And um, yun nga, and just like what I said a while ago, si Alex is an additional, a good addition for the team, especially he's a leader inside the court, and he's an extension for us, sa aming coaching staff. Thank you, Paul. Congrats sa inyo po. Thank you, Ruben. Follow-up question from Mr. Uh, this question is for Alex. Alex, uh, last last uh, last conference, uh, Terra Firma was able to beat your former team San Miguel, no? And uh, now that you're playing here with Terra Firma, uh, can you honestly say, or are you confident that you can carry this team to the next level? I, I don't think um, it's it's my job to carry the team. I think it's a collective effort from everybody, uh, from coaching staff, from management, from every single player. I think it's going to be unfair for me to, uh, and selfish to say, nah, I'm going to carry the team. That's, we all know it's a team sport and everybody has to be clicking. So I'm here to guide. I'm a little bit older now, 32. <laughs> no, but uh, uh, I'm just here to guide. And if, if the players and they have questions, uh, I'm here. I'm here at their disposal. But it's a collective effort, that I got, a collective effort to carry the load. Thank you, Alex. Thank you so much. With no more questions, we end the post-game interview. Thank you very much, Coach and Alex. And congratulations. <laughs> Thanks, Coach. Congratulations. Congratulations. Thanks, guys. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you so much.